Last week, I asked my students, why are you going into this hard technical field? And without any hesitation, one student just blurted out, for the women. Um, not to mention the obvious, but have you looked around the classroom? I mean, the, the ratio here of men to women, uh, the odds are not in your favor. And of course, the whole class was laughing. He was just trolling me. Uh, let's look at some statistics here from my YouTube channel. You can see from my viewers, 89% are male. 11% are female. Of course, we'd like to increase that figure. Females bring such a unique point of view that all of us testosterone-filled men cannot bring to the table. So, But that aside, I've had an awesome day. Look at this Facebook post. Showed up in my Facebook feed just a few hours ago. So excited. I unofficially received an offer today from Google. This is one of my former female students. I taught her algorithms about a year ago with the official one, hopefully coming in a few days. Remember I mentioned Christmas time for teachers, getting students in, graduating them, but the most ultimate Christmas is when they land a job. Not necessarily at Google, it could be any place. But this one, a female, landed a job at Google. That got me stoked. So, of course, I messaged her. I said, hey, woohoo! mind if I share your post on my YouTube channel? Sure, although I'd prefer the name and picture blurred out if possible. There you go. There's my blurring of her name. And picture. I guess I should also thank you for doing such an awesome job on our algorithms class, since that's what a lot of the questions were on. Funnily enough, one of the questions they almost asked was one I'm that I'm pretty sure we did in your class, although NDA says I can't say which one. NDA is non-disclosure agreement. She can't. She had to sign saying she keep her mouth shut. That's awesome. All right, I don't care what problem it was. We'll cover them all. Go interview at Google or whatever epic company you want to work at. Uh, that's just. That made my day. But that's not the only female student who had a Google experience. Here's another one. I got a message over Facebook from another female student of mine. Epic student. I thought it might excite you to know that I have a phone call with Google on Wednesday. That's tomorrow. That's just exciting. I, it's exciting when any student gets a good job interview or job offer. I cannot take full credit for helping these kids get into Google. At the universities, I work at full team of high caliber people. All right, but it and and in the end, it's really on the student to get themselves into Google. We just kind of facilitate the experience, really work them hard, um, and it's up to the student to to land their career and make it happen for them. Anyway, I'm going to respond to a lot of the comments on the previous video and this video, any video. I'll make a separate playlist for that. We're going to get into the technical meat on this playlist, unless I get interrupted by more epicness like this that I have to absolutely share with you guys. Females, please comment. Are you one of the few that watch my videos? I am so honored that you do. Tell me, does or has the number of men versus women in computer science intimidate you? Why did you pick this field? Who or what influenced you to do so? Remember, generally my female students outperform the men. In fact, I just had one of my female students placed at Blizzard. That's pretty epic. For you men, Tell me, how has interacting with women in computer science blessed your skills? What attributes do you feel women bring to this field that us men just can't offer? Please comment. I want to know, and I will respond where I can. 